Welcome back to learning Inkscape and this time I'm going to show you how to create a hello arrow. So there are many ways to do it, but if you want to use the templates for the marker that I inbuilt, just create a line with the PC tool, hold control when you drag it so that it's horizontally in line. Then go to object, fill and stroke, pick your marker, we just use this one, it's fine. And then we size it right here with the width for the stroke, so it affects the marker as well. Just pick a value that fits your design. Then go to path and stroke the path. And now I can click on the X and get rid of the fill and I hold shift and click on the color swatch to give it a stroke. So if I add a fill you can see it's still there. But we only want to have a stroke color. And we adjust it with the width up here once more. I have to go very low for my size. You want to arrive at the point where the arrowhead gets these different strokes and then select it all, shift Control g to ungroup. So we've got two elements now and then shift Control g to ungroup once more and you can drag these lines out of there. And then reposition the end for the line up to here. So that's the basic element, let me size it up a little bit, I'll shift and control when I do. So make sure that you've got this line positioned correctly, so that you don't have these elements exceeding the arrowhead. If you want to make it thicker, just select it all, once again path, stroke the path. But you may run into the problem that right here it gets transformed a little bit. So let me press Ctrl Z and I'll reposition this line. Once more Ctrl A to select it all, path, stroke the path. And now we've got a clean line. So if you want to make it thicker now, you can just select it all and add another stroke. So the previous stroke was now basically turned into the fill and we can add a new stroke on top to make it thicker if you want to have that. In my case I'm fine with what I had previous so I press Ctrl Z to return to this. And now the final question would be how can we get rid of this middle line and we can simply use a rectangle for this. But first make sure that your elements don't have a stroke anymore. So hold shift and click on the X for both. The snapping should help to find these two points. So just drag it from one like this and then reposition it with the cursor tool until it snaps. And now you only have to hold shift and click on this rectangle and afterwards on the element for example this line, both are selected, path and difference. But you need two as we've got the arrowhead as well, so let me press Ctrl D. And I do it two times, once for the line and once for the arrowhead. So shift click on both, shift them both selected, then path and difference. And this is how you can create such a hollow arrow in Inkscape using the templates that are already inbuilt for the markers. I hope this video was helpful, thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.